The way that the day kind of goes, the daily schedule is basically they start off with a theory class and then they move on to either big band rehearsals or combo rehearsals. Then we break for lunch. Then they come back and we have master classes for about an hour and a half, and then they go back into either big band or combo rehearsals. And our master classes are, I think, really wonderful throughout the week. Um, two days of the week, they have master classes with their individual um, teachers, so any all the instruments break up into separate rooms uh, with our George Mason jazz faculty, and they work on specific uh, specifics on their instrument techniques um, or whatever the teacher wants to work with. Right. Okay. Now play those two in a row. One day we have a world percussion masterclass um, uh, led by Joe McCarthy, who is won a Latin Grammy, and I believe it was 2009 with his group Afrobop Alliance. This is a really amazing masterclass that um, works on rhythms. Uh, he brings out congas and bongos. And not only does he speak about rhythm, but he also, with the different instruments, kind of gives them a global perspective about jazz. Our other all-student masterclass is Jazz History, and that's led by Jim Carroll. And he has lots of wonderful stories and just has a, a wonderful approach to teaching jazz history. One thing that really impressed me was uh, Jim Carroll's love for jazz and his desire to really share it with anybody of any ability. Just the, the level of musicianship, the amount of kids that are participating, and then the opportunities are so much greater. They're, the classes that are offered are fabulous. Um, I love that he's taking theory and he's um, also taking a separate master class with the trombones. Um, so all those experiences, you just can't get that at another camp, like all the different classes and then um, being in the bands is invaluable. It's been one of the best weeks of my life. I play the tenor saxophone, so you know jazz is a real uh, focal point of my instrument. And so, you know, once my friend Kenny told me about the, uh, the camp, I just had to, you know, not just because, you know, the saxophone itself, but because I'm from Louisiana. And so, you know, that's, that's my heritage right there, jazz music. So, you know, I had to be a part of the, this, this workshop here. And so, you know, this, this week has been fun simply because that's really all we've got to do is play jazz. It's very interesting to see, to learn how to improvise, especially since I also play piano. And in our improv classes at the very beginning of the day, I can go on the piano and start learning a bit on there. I would definitely recommend this workshop to other people. In fact, I'm thinking about going back home to New Jersey, where I'm actually from, and inviting a few of my friends who are into jazz. I took it two years ago. Um, I, I really enjoyed it when I did it then. It was just a great overall experience in terms of learning my jazz theory and practicing and just everything about it is, you know, it gives me a chance to really focus in on my jazz skills because, you know, I'm primarily a classical bassist actually, but I enjoy playing jazz and it's, it's a good experience for me in every way. At the end of the week, on Friday, uh, the entire uh, intensive culminates in a concert here at the beautiful Center for the Arts Concert Hall stage, where every single student uh, plays uh, with their groups or with the big bands and gets to experience what it's like to be on a real stage. Thank you so much. Thank you so very much, George Mason, Summer, Summer Jazz Workshop. Thank you so much.